Experience Points is geared towards more than just gaming. It is our mission to also encompass various ex communities and life experiences. By using an asset like the IBM World Community Grid, we can enter the health and sciences and reward people for their participation. The IBM World Community Grid is a project that allows users to contribute their unused computing power of their devices to help aid in scientific research. The topics and research relate to health, poverty, and sustainability. It is XP's vision to join the health and science community, expand our reach into various communities, and reward these participants with XP Monthly. The process and procedure is that users will be given a link in which they can sign up and automatically be added to Team XP Coin. Users are awarded in XP for any hashes they submit on a monthly basis. We have a room in our Discord called World Community Grid where participants will have to put their WCG username and their XP addresses to be paid monthly. This step must be completed in order to receive any funds from XP. XP will then take this information and input into a CSV based spreadsheet to track data and payouts. We can access monthly hash rates through the XP Coin team page within the WCG site. Having this information put into a CSV format allows for transparency and up-to-date record keeping process. Now that you know what the World Community Grid is for, I will show you how to join a Community Grid um, and join for Team XP. So first of all, go to our link, which is this one. I will put it in the description. And then once you're on the link, press on join. Now you want to sign up. So I will sign up right now. Once you've signed up, you can choose your project. You can select all projects if you want to. I'll just go for select all projects. And then it's all the installations. So you have to locate Bionic, which is right here. So Bionic has already downloaded. So now we just open it and then install it. Log into it, so with your credentials, and I'll start compute contributing. So, which means we're going to install it. So, accept the license. You can uh, keep it as is. Go in advanced and change whatever you want to change. But uh, we'll keep it as is, and install it. Now that it's installed, you can finish and launch it. Now you log in with your username, password. and project added, press on finish, and move this here. All right, so now this is your Boink Manager. As you see, process suspended because it's benchmarking. So it's testing your computer to see how powerful it is. And now it's waiting to contact the project servers. So let's wait a bit. Receiving, downloading work. All right, mapping ca cancer maker. Project commands, so update, suspend. No new tax, reset project, properties. You see all these properties. You see your username, your team. So I'm currently um, on XP coin team. Right here, you see don't fetch tasks from uh, for NVIDIA GPU. So, so it doesn't use a GPU. So I would assume you use this, your CPU to process whatever work there is. If you go in tools and press on computing preferences, you can choose the hours in between which the community grid will work. You can choose also between which hours the community grid will be able to connect to the internet. Uh, you can allow a amount of disk space for the downloads. You can also limit the processor per percentage, so 10% all the way to 100%. Um, if you're on a laptop, um, do you want to work while your laptop is not plugged in, while it's running on the battery or not? Um, if you're on a PC or even on a laptop, actually, um, if you're not working on it right now, how long do, do you want the computer to wait until it starts working on the community grid? So let's say if you leave your desk for five minutes, you want it to start working, then put it do work after it'll for five minutes. Once you leave for five minutes, it'll start working. Um, I'll just put zero and then press OK once you've done all your
configurations. So that's it for the World Community Grid. I hope this video helped you understand how to install it and how to create your account and how to join the XP team. We want to thank you for your participation in this project and allowing XP to expand into the world of health and science. Be sure to join the XP official Discord so you can earn your XP rewards. And I will see you in another video.